what's up, it's Phil from Fit with Exposed. In today's episode, I'm gonna be talking about Romanian deadlifts and hamstring development. So I'm gonna give you guys two lifts that's gonna help you take your hamstrings to the next level. And that's not to say that the classic Romanian deadlift is a bad lift. I use it in my training, but there is one major flaw and it's range of motion and lack of stretch. So the plates are obviously very big, you know, if you're using 45s and you're not getting the maximum stretch. You could actually be going a bit, a little bit lower to hit extra fibers in the hamstrings to get more stretch, more growth, more range of motion. Okay, so if we look at the classic RDL, it basically looks like this. So I'm pick it up off the floor, okay. Right here. The problem is that I want to go lower than this, or at least a slight bit lower, but I can't because of the floor. The floor is hitting, and that's preventing me from getting that extra range of motion. So the first variation I'm going to introduce you guys to, you guys already know me as the snatch grip guy, it's a snatch grip RDL, because one, it's going to hit your upper back like nothing else, it's obviously good for posture, it's going to help increase the conventional um, Romanian deadlift variation, and it's a great lift to have into the mix. So. Basically, just grab the, grab the right outside the second ring. Now it starts like right above my hip, right? So now I'm way higher, so if I go lower, I won't be touching the floor because I'm getting that extra range of motion. So. We just discussed the snatch grip RDL. Now I want to talk about the deficit pause RDL. It's a great movement overall for obviously getting more stretch, but with the clean grip. And now we got the pause component in it. So we've got this crazy stretch going on and we're pausing for one to three seconds at the bottom. Now I like to do these like a lot of the bodybuilders do them where I'll pull it right off the rack and then I'll start the set. Bodybuilders like doing this because they could just start off with the eccentric right off the bat and it makes them a lot stronger. They don't have to waste all this energy just getting into starting position. So it looks like this. Step on it. Push the hips back. See the range of motion I'm getting? Pause. Now, if you don't have the flexibility or the mobility to do this lift properly, work on that first. But if you do have the flexibility and mobility, it's definitely a staple. Yes, there you guys have it. Those are my top two favorite Romanian deadlift variations to take your hamstrings to the next level. Snatch grip RDL and the deficit pause RDL. So give one of these two variations a try. Let me know what you think. Let me know how your hamstrings respond. As far as programming, you know, you can do these like once a week. As far as the rep ranges are concerned, you can throw these in on a heavy day. You can do them for high reps. I like doing them from, you know, anywhere from 5 to 20 reps on average. I don't really like maxing out on RDLs. So you'll never see me do like one to five reps. But 5 to 20 is pretty much where I live with these two exercises. So let me know what you think in the comment section below. Hope your hamstring training goes well. See you guys next time.